All right, you guys, we are in Australia. We are on day two. We made our kangaroos and our joeys yesterday. So cute. So cute. You oh. can't really see what I'm doing. You there we go. Adorable joey. All right, so put that aside. Look at our letter A is for Australia. Top corner kind of has the outline of what Australia looks like. And Miss Rachel went over yesterday with the flag um, and the colors and the stars in the Southern Cross. Um, all right, so we have A, capital A, lowercase a. Sorry, guys. It's one of those ones that's a little crazy because we have an A that looks like this as a capital and our lowercase kind of looks like a C and then you kind of like block it off. That's the best way I could describe that one. Um, or like half of a O. Um, so this is one of the ones that looks totally different. And for further confusion, sometimes you will see it, I don't even know if I can make this upside down, like, like that. Well, not with so much of a tail, but does that look right from your angle, Ms. Yes. Rachel? Yes, yep. Um, a so yeah. a lot of the times you will see it like that, um, like 90% of the time too. So if you look, okay, that is also an A right there. Yep. All right. So there's your confusion for you. All right. So get your fingers ready. Warm them up. Look at me. Look at that. I'm rocking and rolling today. All right. So with our capital A, we are going to start at the top. And we're going to draw a straight line down towards the angle. And then we're going to go back to the top and draw a straight line down to the other angle. And we're going to give them a little crossover. Okay? So top, down, top, down, cross it over. All right? If I took this and parted it with that still in the middle, what letter would that be? Hmm. I don't know. It's Chrissy. What do you think it is? That would be an H. Ah, yeah, there you go. You see? Yeah. Um, so we're pretty much just closing our H, our capital H. All right. Um, all right, so lowercase a, we are going to draw a little straight line down, half the size, and then just circle it around. So straight line down, circle it around, grab your markers, and let's try doing this with our markers. Straight line down on an angle. Straight line down on an angle. Give it a little cross. Okay. Straight down. Straight down. And then cross. All right. Same thing with the lowercase. We're going to start with our straight line down. Half the size. And then loop it around. Straight line down. And loop it around. If you want to get all fancy on me. There you go. Yep. <laughs> All right. That's a uh, lesson for another day. There you go. All right. So we have A is for Australia. Any more? I see a couple more A's. I do. All right. I see this A right here. You got it. And this A at the end. Is that all of them? That is. Yep. Other than mine that I drew. <laughs> all right. You ready for guessing game? Oh, yeah. All right, this one's easy. Well, you know, I say everything's easy, but... Okay, so that doesn't look like that. <laughs> Let's try again. <laughs> hmm. Apple? Apple. Perfect. Uh, oh, we have one of those up there, too. We do. Oh, yeah, there's right the there. apple. Yep. All right. If you look up in the sky... How we traveled to Australia. On a big airplane. airplane. It looks like a bird. <laughs> that is my airplane. Especially with the one eye. I know, right? Maybe I, I need to give it some more. more. Windows. There you go. <laughs> um, yes, I, I hopped in my uh, airplane and I flew for many hours. Many hours. Like 24 hours. <laughs> um, but I will do it one day. One day. One day. Um, let's see. How about, well, I don't know if I can, I don't know if you're going to be able to guess this one. 
I see it in my head, but. Uh, this is not gonna, this is not gonna go over well. Wait a minute, I think I might know. Maybe. Is that mm. an ape? Yeah, I was trying to draw an ape. That does okay, not look right. anything <laughs> like an ape. So I'm gonna write ape because that is my version of an ape. <laughs> That's really bad. He's precious, Miss Chrissy. Okay, but that's, that's what I see when I think of an ape. <laughs> okay, all right. Um, what else? What else can we draw? Hmm. Think, think, mm -hmm. think. Think, think, think. Oh, man. Um, why am I drawing a... Oh, oh, oh. I got one. Got one, got one. Of course... Hopefully you'll be able to figure it out. Kind of something like that. Oh, wait, did they have big sharp teeth in the front? Yeah. Oh, is that an alligator? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's my alligator. He's adorable. <laughs> kind of looks like a lizard. Yeah, he kind of does, but he's cute. Yeah. He's All cute. All right. All right. Okay. If you flip it over. We have some Australian things from the land down under. That's right. All right, Aussie. <laughs> All right, we have our koala. Again, very cute animals. Just, you know, let them be. Let them be. Yeah, just leave them alone. You can look at them. All you want, but don't just try to touch them, them or let them just let they them go. Are wild animals. Indeed. Um, what is this that they're hanging on? I believe that is a eucalyptus tree. That mm -hmm. is what they live in, and that is what they eat. They do. They love that. All right. So our goal is to look at all the pictures, count them, and then find which number matches. All right. We can handle that. Kind of easy. All right. How many koalas do I have? I see one koala. All right. Is this one? Is this one? Or this one? This is number one. All right. Give it a little... Color in. Color it in. Um, when you are ready, you can also try to draw the number, give it a little dot, do whatever. Perfect. All right. Look at our boomerangs. They're kind of cool. Those are precious. Love uh, them. Yeah. Miss Chloe put um, our little logo on there. <laughs> I love it. Um, they th can throw these. They can come back to you. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of them use it for hunting. Yes. Believe it or not. Yes. Um, so, yeah. Be careful. We are um, going to make those... Actually, I'll show you when we're done this. Um, it's part of your bonus, but I'll show you. All right, so how many do we have? One, two, three, four. All right. Mm. What number's that? That's three. That's not right. That's four. That's four. That's five. That's five. So we're going to do this one. Look at that four. You'll see it that way sometimes, and then this way other times. Okay, we try to show thing. you both ways. All right, and then you can do your four. All right, the flags. One, two, we have two crosses. Do you see that cross in there? Yep, that's it. There it is. Perfect. All right, so two. All right. There it is. There it is right off the bat. We First have two, one. three, and four. Let me see if I can write this upside down. Yep, good job. All right. Then we have, those are adorable little birds. One, two, three, four, five. They are called a, a certain type of bird. Cuckoo. Cuckooburras. Cuckooburras. That's it. It's easy. Like, oh, that's what they are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. yeah, 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 yeah. Cuckooburras. So we have one, two, three, four, five. I think I stumped Miss Rachel on that one. Yeah, you did. <laughs> yeah. All right. So we have five. We have five. Four, five, and six. So we want this four again. I mean, oh, ah! Miss. Just kidding. You want them. One, two, three, four, five! five. There it Miss is. Chrissy. Right way? That is correct. Do, do, do. Perfect. All right. Sydney Opera House. Beautiful. Look at that. We're going to make that too. Such a unique building. Ours so is pretty. really going to look like that too. It's, yeah, it's, it's going to be cool. Amazing. Okay, so we have one, two, three. All right. Mm, nope. Two, three. Yep. And that's a four. That's the one. All right. That is correct. Nice job. Perfect. Okay. Kangaroos. 
with their little joeys in there. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Got four, five. No? Nope. Six it there is. There it is. All right. And our kangaroos are almost in the same pattern. Perfect. Okay. All right. Koalas. Down here, we are going to do symmetry. We're going to try to draw the other side of our koala face. Where do I want to start? Hmm. Probably I here. Yeah. The little snout. It's cute. <laughs> All right. And then let me see if I can do the eye and match them up. I'm kind of just kind of, I think it's a little crooked. Beep. Maybe right about there. That's good. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right, so this one's kind of an arch. So maybe, maybe there. Oh, Not yeah. too bad. Not too bad. All right, and then it kind of goes back up for the ear. And maybe right about there. And then maybe I'll start down here and bring it to it. Oh, look at that's, that's pretty, pretty good. good. That's pretty good. Just missing some ear hair. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. It's open on this end and goes in. Very cool. That's pretty cute. That's yeah. pretty cute. Maybe we should give it a little smile. Oh, look at that. What a happy, friendly koala. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Last one. We're just going to practice some of our um, fine motor skills. And we're going to trace the lines and see what we can find. Australia is surrounded by ocean. Uh, very, very beautiful coral reefs. One of the reasons that I would love to go there. I would love to go snorkeling, scuba diving. Maybe scuba diving. Definitely snorkeling. Um, so, starfish. Right? Let's find that. And starfish starts with that S starfish. I don't think I want to run into him, but he's mm. probably there a lot. He is, yeah. It's his home. It so. is, it is. Yeah. All right. Shark. Shark. All right. Coral. The coral is in all different colors and sizes and shapes. Um, they even have some that look like, um, they call it brain coral. Yeah. It's very cool. So it's more like squiggly like this. With like, it literally looks like a brain. Amazing. All right. We have our little fish. There are so many different types of fish there. Beautiful tropical fish. Ours is just orange, but they're beautiful. All right. And then we have our octopus. Right there. Starts with the letter O. How many legs does the octopus have, Miss Rachel? An octopus has eight legs. Eight legs. Eight legs. Do you want to go and see those? Yeah. Would you go snorkeling? I would. Yeah. Would you go scuba diving? I don't know if I'd go that yeah. commitment, but have it sounds beautiful. The he helmets that they put over so yeah. that you're in case you're claustrophobic. I Maybe I would do that. Do that. Yeah, yeah, I might do that. I might yeah. do that. All right. I promised um, I would show you... Are cool little boomerangs because when you're in Australia, I mean, why not, right? All right. So you have white. And you have some orange. And I really, if you have other colors at your house and you want to change this up, go for it. Go for it. Just kind of got to unravel it. All right. So we have two different colors. This one is shorter than the orange. Okay, so, hmm, any way you want to wrap it, <coughs> excuse me, just pick a area, put it in, and then you can start wrapping. I know that the white is shorter, and I'm going to do the middle with that. With that. Um, so maybe, Miss Chrissy, maybe I want to do this first. I think I want to do my orange first that way because I'm seeing it in my head and I want my white to cover up my orange string that I'm gonna connect over do, 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 do. 
All right. So I'm going to start on this end. And I'm just going to wrap and wrap and wrap and wrap and wrap and wrap and wrap. All right. I'm not going to do this whole thing for you, but just so you have an idea. Okay, you can keep going. And then, you know, wherever you want to go, maybe halfway, jump over to the other side and keep wrapping all the way to the end. And then you can go back with your white because like I said, it is not as much as the orange and maybe fill in the middle. And so it kind of has this orange, white, orange pattern. Do you see that coming together? Oh yeah, for sure. It's awesome. Okay. All right, I'm not gonna do the whole thing, guys, because you can do this on your own time, but send me some pictures. I'd love to see what you do. Um, you can even, you know, mix it up and maybe you wanna in intermingle this white with your orange that you already have too. That sounds cool. Yeah. Make a little design over it. Yeah. So anyway, that's your boomerang. Feel free to throw it. Just don't throw it in anybody's eyes. And I promise you that these will not come back to you. Yeah, no, they are not 